everyone! What I just played was the Samba Groove and I'll break it down for you in this tutorial video. First, we want to establish the Samba Bass Groove. It is the backbone to the groove, it makes us dance and it goes like this. To achieve the bass groove, what I'm doing here is an alternate flip-flop groove going on between two hands. I'm releasing the flip-flop on alternate hands every odd count. Let me show you. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 3, 5, 7. 1, 3, 5, 7. Here's a slow-mo video. If you want an in-depth instruction to learn how to play this, I will place the link up here to our Asalato basic tutorial. Fine. Now that we got our bass groove, it's time to add our clicks and form our samba groove. Check this out. Two things I want to point out. First, we need to learn two main rhythm patterns that we can combine to get our samba groove. Secondly, the clicks that I'm adding are on opposite hands of the flip-flop hand. For example, I am doing my flip-flop on the right hand. The click will happen on the left hand. If my flip-flop is on the left hand, my click will be on the right hand. So this is a bit tricky because we have to put our clicks in between our flip-flops when we are doing our samba bass groove. Let's start with the first rhythm pattern, the one E A. This gets tricky because with the bass rhythm 1, a 2, a 3, a 4, a, we are going to add a click on the E. Notice that the click comes after the 1, which is on the flip. For example, Now let's move on to the next rhythm, the one and a. This time your click comes closer to the a, which is on the flop. For example, So I just want to point this out, the speed of the click is important to establish the two different patterns, one N A and one E A. After you have the rhythm patterns, let's combine it to form our samba groove. So our samba groove starts with a one N A followed by two sets of one E A on counts two and three, and for the last count we have one N A. So we have one and a two E, a three E, a four and a one and a two E, a three E, a four and a one and a two E, a two E, a four and a I hope you enjoyed this tutorial video. I'll see you in the next one.